guys so I'm doing another um, brand for the series my favorite brand that I'm doing with Fashion Queen 27 check her out she started the series and I'm just at as she does a look as I said before she does um, a video I'll do one so this is my second video which I've yet to upload the first one so enough of that so I really like elf eyes lips face and most times you can find your products online all the time at eyeslipsface.com but they're starting to branch out into Target I believe and maybe makeup.com I saw uh, makeup.com having their their information on their site but they're not fully up yet so we'll see anyway I really love um, elf products for the most part probably 9 out of 10 times or 8 out of 10 times out of 10 times I really like the product or love the product that I purchased from them so I'm gonna start with their brushes I like these I love their studio line brushes and their regular line um, eyeshadow brushes they're great this is the angle brush and all my brushes are dirty Yuck. this is the angle brush this is the um, shadow brush which picks up a lot of color and you know it packs on the color nicely I really really like this and with the angle brush you can take it in the crease especially I have a very I have a, um, a hooded eye or hooded eyes so um, this goes nicely into my little crease <laughs> and you can use it to highlight and um, to put on color as well and to blend the color in the crease send over there and this is their blending brush. This is the one that um, came with their mineral kit. Yeah, this is the one that came with the min mineral kit. And I really like this because it is a small blending brush, but as I just said, I've um, put it eyes. So this works really nicely for me. Get in there. Yeah. And their face or complexion brush, which I use as a blush brush or to contour. I like it for that. I don't like it for all over the face. Maybe it will work for someone with a smaller, tiny face. Um, but it doesn't work for me. I mean, it's just the way it's shaped. It's dirty. I use it today. It's dirty, but I just, I like, it's flat and slim this way. So I use it and it lays the color on nicely. But it picks up a lot of um, products, so you have to be careful when applying. And um, this brush, which is their powder brush, and I don't use this for powder, I use this for liquid foundation, and I really, 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 really love this brush. It just, it gives you a nice finish, it smooths on the product nicely, it's just, I really like it, a lot. Okay, so I also like their pressed powder, now I don't use, I don't know how this would work all over my face, because it's too light for me. That's one thing I didn't like because it's caramel, but this caramel is a very, it um, almost looks like what would be beige usually, but there it is. Um, I use it as under my eye like this. I'm just going to use my um, blush brush. I just go under the eye and it just lightens up or brightens up under the eye. You probably can't see that. My light is probably too bright. And I just go under and it sets my um, concealer nicely and I really like it and I've had it for a while but yeah because I only use a small amount and um, the bronzer the golden bronzer this is a very very nice bronzer I've played in it a little <laughs> but this is a nice blush right here I use this I don't really use this part I've tried using it but I don't know I don't really use it I don't know what to use it for maybe to highlight but I don't really use it a lot but these the, um, the bronzer side are great they look matte this one is a darker shade which I used to contour and this one I, I haven't touched yet because this one um, matches me nicely so I mostly use these two um, the blush side and the and see picks up a lot of product and the um, bronzer side okay and I really like this I like this a lot I also have a few of their blushes. I also have the mineral blush, which I didn't bring, but I like the mineral blush. Um, my the one that I have is I came from the dark kit that I got, so I like that too. But I like their um, 
blushes. This one is from their studio line, and this one is in Mellow Mauve. Very pretty color. This one is in, it's very shimmery, it's in Berry Mary. And it's beautiful. It's a beautiful color. There it is. It's very, it's gorgeous. I love it. And this one is in, I believe, Blushing Rose. It's a very nice color, and I really like them. I, I like, I like pretty much like all the blushes. Some of them are too light for me, so they're just sitting in my um, storage, makeup storage. But that's fine. Also, I have um, quite a few of their eyeshadows, but I only brought out two. And there are many things that I have that I didn't bring out because I, I didn't want the video to be too long. But this one is in um, buttercream, and this is a gorgeous, gorgeous for just putting all over the lid or um, um, as an as a highlight it's just very pretty it's like a um, soft you know butter gold type color there it is it's just a very pretty color it's it's gorgeous and it goes on very gold and soft anyway um, this one is in amethyst I believe amethyst and it's a gorgeous color. It's like a purple color. Very pretty. And my battery's dying. <laughs> and the lipsticks that I have, right now I have on Natural Nymph. And on top of it, I have on um, NYX Real Nude Lip Gloss. And I really like Natural Nymph, but it can be scary. Because it looks, you know, very white. It's just like Max um, Myth. Mommy's doing something with boom. That's the color. Um, but it's they're very soft. Um, they're long lasting. I really, really like their mineral lipsticks. I really like them. This one is in um, Prime Plum. And this one is in Nicely Nude, which is a pink color, but it goes on almost sheer. It's just a nice nudey pink. Mommy's doing something, baby. And I love this bronzer, but it's a little bit hard to blend, but it's a gorgeous, gorgeous color. It's just, there it is. It's gorgeous. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful color. It's just a tad bit hard to blend out while wow, I put too much on, but it's nice. And last but not least, I have their nail polish, which I really like, and everyone should have this. This came in the um, the the kit for the French the French kit. I never had this. Um, this is the second one I um, I have. The first one was before I was into makeup and stuff, which I used off. And I really like. I think now they call this their tinted moisturizer, but I like it. Um, it's a little bit too dark for me, so I use it to contour. If I want a darker look on my face, I will use it. And that's it for um, this series of uh, my favorite brand. If you have any questions or anything, just let me know.